shall thus consecrate the 50th year and proclaim a release through the land to all its inhabitants. It shall be a jubilee for you. Leviticus 25, 1-4, 8-10 A time to celebrate 50 years of service in the Lord. I was born at Fort Cochin on 21st August 1943. So I was interested to become a missionary priest, not so much interested to become a secular priest. So I came to Benares along with Varshilanath, started my studies. So being an Indian Missionary Society, you always insist on that it is a missionary congregation. All orientation is to preach the word of God. We are pioneering missionaries. So the people are asked to cooperate. So we have great satisfaction because the building of the kingdom has been done in this. I have um, uh, produced, uh, putting uh, the Hindustani music behind, I have uh, made one cassette, or just called, one or two, three, two, three cassettes. One is Eshanama Kirtanam, other one is Krupa Sagaram, and also uh, the whole mass has been sung in Malayalam. And recently I have produced uh, uh, the Psalms as it is, was <coughs> uh, first volume and then second volume. Dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ, it's a proud moment for all of us. Indeed, we are celebrating the golden jubilee of our father Vinayanand IMS. All of us know him very well. And we are, we, the members who are faithful of the Archdiocese of Telichari, is much obliged to him because he has started the Dhyana Gendra, IMS Dhyana Gendra retreat house at Kutubada. Even now the, uh, the uh, retreat center is functioning. I know very well many, many people have gone there and heard his preaching and uh, renewed their life. Not only Father Vinayanan started the retreat program here at Kutubada, he also started the same retreat house at Alepi. Uh, the Lord has blessed Father Vinayanand with good health, I think. So, let me take this opportunity to wish him the name of the whole lives of Telicheri. Happy Jubilee, happy Jubilee greetings. May God Almighty bless him abundantly. May, may the Lord give him long life and good health also. And the Jeevila Anifovitile, Nirashi Dukhaim Vedanim Talangetti Nenirinna Uri Savajiritile Ane. ഞാൻ <laughs> I was born in November 25th in Bambali near Kuravalangar Kotain district. My parents were happy 
when I was born. I had not seen my mother. My mother passed away in the early stage of 30 days after my birth. I, one day, I, after the mass, I met Father Nidhi and there comes my call to IMS. So I started my journey to Benares on 29th June with my companions, Father Jyotilal and Father Subhash. My first profession was in 1971. And lo looking after many work, any work is for the glory of God. So I was feeling happiness in doing some work. Brother Vinay Prakash, my con hearty condolences to you on the occasion of your Golden Jubilee celebrations. It's a matter of great joy that you are in the Mother House to celebrate your Jubilee. After your profession, you worked in various communities of IMS. Mostly you spent your time in Krishnagar as the refectorian. You also worked some years in Kork and in some of our mission stations, Benipur, Kotwa, Soha, Bitari, Sonipat. You are with me in Sonipat. It was a nice time together. After 50 years, when I recollect you, what comes to my mind is, uh, first of all, you are a person of prayer. I have seen you many times spending a lot of your time for personal prayer. And you have been very, very regular also for your community prayer. And you have spent some longer period in the Bilaspur Retreat Center showing your interest for personal and spiritual renewal. Good evening, I am Sandhya Vodhiyo. And I Juba Brother to give the Golden Jubilee in the Golden Jubilee. And we give chocolate for the children. When I think about uh, Brother's past experience, Yes, I well remember wherever he lived, wherever he worked. People never forget him. All the people, yes, remember him very well. Members also cannot forget him. Such are the experiences of people. And all his past experience have made him at present an excellent expert. For example, he is an excellent cook for some celebrations, maybe Easter, maybe Christmas. If we entrust him our kitchen, that is enough. Next day we will see the miracles of Vinay Prakash on the dining table. This is a fact. He has got a vegetable garden, he has got a herbal garden, he has got a fruit garden. He has his own garage, workshop, he makes a candles for our purpose. Every day morning at 5 o'clock when you go to the chapel, we can see such long candles burning in, in front of St. Joseph and Our Lady statue. This is for one, not for one day, all throughout. I wish again congratulations prayers and love on your 50 years of unforgettable moments. God bless you.